Welcome back everybody to Express. Let's take a look into how we can add or pay your Shopify with a credit or a debit card. The process is actually really, really simple. So let's go directly and jump right into the process. So the very first thing you want to do is to go into the little pod, go into settings. Inside the settings section of your own dashboard of Shopify, let's focus into plan. Usually the plan details should be appearing in here. And then what you can do is to try to update your payment method in order to pay for your new plan into Shopify. So let's go into add a payment method. This one should be asking you to add a credit card. Usually credit card doesn't matter if it appears as the credit card. You can add your own debit card if you want to. So you add your credit number, your expires, C double B, and all the information about your billing address. After that, choose add the credit card and you should see that your debit card is actually working through Shopify so you don't have to be worrying about anything at all. The second method that just in case this actual credit card, uh, adding it as a debit card is not working, is to choose another currency that can be helping you to get started with. So you want to make sure that back in here, inside your store details, you wanted to check it out what is the store currency that is available that your product is selling on for your payout currency and go to the payment settings. So usually in my case, one accepts Mexican peso, that means MXN. So that means that if I go back into my plan, update my payment method, and go into add payment method, I am able to pay not only with the credit card, but with PayPal as well. So what does the PayPal actually working for me? If I choose to pay with PayPal, directly into PayPal what I can do is to add a debit card so I can receive the actual charging stuff from PayPal directly from my debit card. So I can go here into pay and get paid. Let's go into banks and cards. I linked a new card and here I can link a debit or a credit card number. Now I have the card type, the expiration date, the security code, and the billing address. After that, I hit now into linked a card, and now that my card has now been successfully added, I can choose the pay with PayPal. So this one should be sending me directly into this new notification section to pay directly with my PayPal account, and here into agree and continue. And with that being said, this is how we can pay with our debit card directly from Shopify. So as you can see, it's not that hard to add this verification process directly into your Shopify. You just wanted to make sure what are the elements that your country uh, enables into Shopify. So thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, guys. If you want to see more great tools of how you can get started by paying stuff into Shopify and much more. Thank you once again for watching the video. See you next time.